What's going on guys, Daniel King Gaming here, welcome back to the Walking Dead Delta series. When the dead started walking, I was small and alone. Until a man named Lee became my protector. Rest in peace, Lee. Lee protected other people too. Uh. But he couldn't save everyone. He could never save everyone. The living Sad, were just as dangerous as the dead. A woman in our group named Lily lost her dad, and then she just couldn't cope. I think she. Died? She took the life that yeah. Lee saved. Lee left her on the side of the road. I wouldn't do Lee it again, though. How to survive? He protected me as long as he could, but he got bit because of me. And even in the end, he was still teaching. Just I remember telling her that. Lee wouldn't make it. He knew it was the end. Still pisses me he off. Made one final request. We all know what he chose. He asked me to shoot him. Still pissed off. And I did. <laughs> it was the right thing to do. I met another group after that. Broken people. Running from their past. There was a woman who gave birth to a boy named Alvin Jr. Poor Rebecca. AJ, he made it. But the mom didn't. I protected AJ. And I started to take care of him. But then, Jane left AJ in the snow. We thought he was gone forever. That was the last straw for Kenny. And without Lee around, I had to make the call. Hey, I didn't raise that gun. I didn't raise I that gun. And Kenny killed Jane. It turned out AJ was alive. Jane hid him to make a point. Knowing what they'd done... I still decided we were better together. For AJ's sake. But like everything else... It wouldn't last. AJ and I traveled to a new frontier. I thought we'd found something that worked. But I was wrong again. They took AJ from me. Said I was too young to take care of him. A load of horse shit. Let's be honest. I thought maybe they were right. I said my goodbyes. I regretted it later. I searched for a long time. Just when I gave up hope, I found him. Yeah, We're searching baby. together now for a place we can call home. I'm all AJ has. He's all I have. And I'll protect him with my life. Just like Lee did for me. I'm still kind of upset that we didn't get to save um, Trip. Still upset about it. But, you know. Wow, the graphics look even better now. <laughs> Speed limit 30. Okay. Walker is crawling. You'll get there eventually. Oh. Damn, Clem, your hat's old. You got an order too. Alright. And oh. AJ has become an eight year old now. That is crazy. What you doing there, goofball? Pretending we got bullets. Well don't. Oh it's nice. on my nerves. I don't like goofball. I'm too big for it. 
How about shipbird? <laughs> I've always called you goofball. It's time for you to stop. It's Alvin Jr. AJ still work? AJ still works. What's wrong? AJ? Hungry. I know, buddy. I know. Hey there, Alvin Jr. It's me, Disco Broccoli. Word on the street is that you want to eat me. Is that true? Do you want to eat me? <laughs> Come on, Clem. I can't eat a toy. Oh man. My feelings are hurt. My stomach hurts. Hmm. <laughs> Sassy. <laughs> That's pretty good. Here, practice your reading. But I don't wanna. It'll take your mind off your stomach. Preheat oven. Place oh, cream. Give him a food book. Vanilla be beans. Into a saucepan and bring to a boy. Uh, on second thought, never mind. That's only gonna make you hungrier. Gonna say it, this kid can read for his age. Here you go. About all we got. Damn. What about you? Go for it. We'll find something else soon. I'll just eat the I toy, I guess. You. I think every season has had that little disco broccoli guy. It's a little weird in my opinion. We always see that little broccoli dude. Like, what is it? Is it supposed to be there for fucking jokes? Like... Oh, here, eat this. By the way, guys, just hit 700 subscribers. Thank you so much. We're 300 away from a thousand, so thank you. I just hit a thousand followers on Twitch, by the way. Thank you. It? Seriously. Think so. Looks clear. We're doing it. Yeah. Let's do this. Friendly ring bell. Yikes. Hmm, let's see here. What is that? Is that a toy with a bullet hole in it? That's pretty cool. Better take the canteen. We need water too. Damn, haven't had clean water in days. I think that's everything. Hmm. All right. Let's find some food. You know, I saw this, and I don't know if it's real, but I kind of want to do it. Friendly, ring the bell. What does it mean? It means the people here shoot first. And ask questions later. But you know what? Because I'm an asshole. What are you doing? Oh. -ho. Hey, you're going the wrong way. Oh, that walker's more stupid than I am. Walker, what? Oh, there he comes. Is he coming? Yeah, he's just taking his time. Anyway, guess we can look around too. I don't see anything. Here, Walker, Walker! AJ, stay back. Oh, we actually get to fight him. Let's go. Hell yeah. Awesome. It's down. Still with me? Still here. No bites. 
Next, well, we get you in should there. see the freeze. Remember, guys, after the season, we are coming back to the. Um, well, we're not coming back, but we are going to be doing the Mass Effect series. Very excited for that. So. Whoever used to grow things here is long gone. Nothing really here to look at, if I'm being honest, but. Oh god, I'm not drinking that. I don't know what's in that trash can. I don't even want to know what's in that trash I'm not drinking that. Okay. Oh, it's a tire swing. Monster trap? <laughs> it's not a trap. You swing on it. For fun? You get in the tire and someone pushes you so that you go really high. Oh, I, I never try. really liked tire swings. After we clear this place. They don't make the tires big enough for kids, if I'm being honest. Anything over here? The deer skull. Hmm, interesting. <laughs> What was that? You have collected deer skull, possible hood ornament? Oh, that is awesome. Anyway, I'm not really seeing anything else over here. I guess we can go. Where's the front door? Oh. Good thing we brought the crowbar, anyway. Right, time to kick the door. What do we do inside a new place? We listen for monsters. After that? Uh... Come on, you remember. We... Inside a new place? We always... Check the check windows. Check the windows. That's right. My bad guys, forget to turn my phone off. Gonna do that right now. Yeah, shut up, phone. Anyway. Ooh, well, that's a hmm. shitty way to go out. Monsters. All tied up. They can't get us? And you're gorgeous. <laughs> no, they can't. Hmm. Windows are all boarded up. Your choice will determine what he will become. This one's locked. Security door. Hm, can't pry that open. He's gonna become I a know good you're kid. Hungry. I am too. We'll find something. I promise. Mark my word, AJ will become a good kid. Okay, anyway, let's look around for a moment. Uh, we'll talk to AJ too. They ate well. Oh. For their last meal. I'm gonna say this the graphics on here are pretty good, honestly. Spectacular. Beans! <gasps> Homemade. Might be more where this came from. Honestly, if we could find...
Oh. Please leave us alone. This is what we wanted. Well, you're dead. You don't really get a choice. And... Yeah. Poison. Did they give up? They wanted to leave this world together. Holding hands in their own home. Will They're walkers. Home? We'll see. But this opens the lock. <sighs> That's not happening. Do Let's we just kill him. Mm, it's risky. Might be another way through that door. Let's look around. Let's be smart. They're walkers. Right. They don't have feelings. They're not even looking at me. Too small to crawl Hello? through. Well, for me. The key or the window. Those are our options. It's dark in there. We should kill the monsters. They're not people. Good, good job, AJ. Well, they You're used smart. to be people. And as people, they ask to be left alone. So what's best? <sighs> I'll get the key. I mean, they're dead. They can't really feel, you know. I'm sorry. Anybody outside? A little creepy, if I'm being honest. Huh. They had a good thing going here. Can we stay here? We'll see. No one's here. No one's ever anywhere. It's always just monsters. I'm here, kiddo. I know. Are you saying I'm not someone? That's not what I mean. Just a few. Remember what we said? You know this. Always, Always aim for the head. Right. Come on, let's keep looking. There's gotta be something we can eat. Hope so. Hmm. Nothing good back that way. Gotta keep searching in here. Okay. The crib. You didn't see a kid. No. No, we didn't. Might be why they gave up You good? Uh-huh. Just hungry. Grumbly and your tumbly? <laughs> no, just regular hungry. A little weird. Oh. Spoiled. Sorry, buddy. These are long gone. Fuck. You said it, kiddo. 
Shit, Ain't but... that the truth? Look. Huh. Something under here. Oh. Floor door? Trap door. Oh, yeah. I must have wanted to hide something. All right. Do all the hard work. Oh, it's a bunch of food. That's a lot Thank of God. stuff. Yeah, it is. We could eat for weeks with this much. Oh shit! It's a grenade. It's rigged. What was that? God, Lee. AJ. Uh oh. Monster. Uh, we gotta go. Fuck. We need to get back to the we're car. We're good, we're good. You know what to do. Oh, Stick give me a break. And be my eyes while I clear a path. Oh, man. No! Of course I messed up. Of course. You know what to do. Stick to the sides and be my eyes while I clear a path. I pressed Y instead of B. That's my bad. Get in, AJ. The, the knife, AJ. Give me the knife. Don't use the key. Oh, boy. Oh, great. Yay, we're trapped in a car. Just great. Get off him. We're good, we're good. Oh, get it off! What, we're fine, we're fine. Oh, we're not fine. We are not fine. We are not fine. Crap, man. Give me those keys. Give me those keys. Yeah, thank you. We're leaving now. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Start. Damn, start. Yeah. AJ, buckle up. Oh no.
Are we joining the group? I don't know. The final season, though. Oh, we're awake. Apparently somebody saved us. Apparent, right? I don't know who. Is there a way to get out of here? What is this place? I don't know what this place is, but I don't like it. Somebody was taking care of us, but, uh... Picture book. Oh, this is sad. EFFs. Oh, I didn't search everything in here. Come on now. Peroxide. Explains the uh, wound. Damn. Where the hell am I? I'm not sure where we are. Don't like it, but uh, something tells me we're locked in here. But uh, I want to look around. This place is all run down too. Oh, I want whatever that is. Could have a. Uh, Can't reach Clem. I like her jacket and everything, but like the clothes now are just all dirty. Like, does anyone wash clothes anymore? What's in here? This'll do. Why? Why is that in that box? It's a. Uh, okay. Yeah, I guess it was good to grab that knife. Hello. Anybody there? Yeah, I'm a little scared. Like I, I don't feel safe in here. Don't know why. Damn, that's rude. You suck. <coughs> Nothing over here. I make the rules. Okay. What about the door here? <laughs> Are we? What about the knife? Can't you use the knife? Okay. Guess we'll go the other way. <gasps> oh shit. Oh, it's a kid. Whoa, 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 whoa. A 
I'm right here. What? Put down the knife. But you do the same. Oh shit. We're not gonna hurt you. We've got your boy, he's safe. I'll take you to see him. Just put down the knife. Your turn. Okay. See? We're not gonna hurt you. I don't trust you. But, uh... Need AJ. I'm Marlon. The little guy's Tennessee. Ten, for short. He's the one been taking care of you. He, uh, doesn't talk much. Clementine. Sorry about locking the door and tying you to the bed and all. You were in uh, pretty rough shape when we found you. You had to take precautions, you know, just in case. No need to explain. Like you said, I was in pretty rough shape. Yeah, to say the least. It must have been tough out there for the both of you. Anyway, I didn't. It was. Straight. Just being cautious. Sorry if it came across the wrong way. But you're safe now, and so is your friend. Come on. Let's go see your boy. Mm. So far, I'm getting a chance to uh, understand a little bit about these guys. I think kids run this area, but I'm not sure. Yeah, it's kids. You've been surviving out there a while, huh? Yeah, we've been on the road a long time. Take it you know how to handle yourself? Don't usually see people our age alone out in the wild. I can't imagine what that must have been like. Sure, I do what I can to get by. No matter what. Hey, don't worry about it. We all do what we have to. It's good we found you when we did. It wasn't easy getting you two out of that wreck. Walkers were on the way. The car, was it totaled? Yeah. Fuck. Damn it. Had to work fast. I don't know what would have happened if we hadn't seen the smoke. I uh, appreciate it. All alone with the kid? Not a pleasant thought. I've seen some rough scenes. Uh, hi there. <laughs> What's his problem? You're just new. I mean, we haven't seen anything like you in... ever. What is this place? You can probably tell it used to be a school. Now it's whatever we want it to be. And who's in charge? Uh, well... I am. It probably sounds strange, kids run by a kid, but... We do alright for ourselves. We've got good walls, good defenses. Good location, too. No one really comes out this way anymore. Huh. Only kids. That actually sounds kind of awesome. You think so? I like it myself, but I'm probably a little biased. It wasn't always like this, though. There used to be a lot of us, but... I know how it goes. I got us a system in place that works well enough. Allow me to make it formal. Welcome to Erickson's boarding school for troubled youth. You and your boy... Feels like you both fit that description. It's hard to survive too long these days without being a bit... troubled. I was pretty good as a kid before everything changed. Made a lot of trouble since then. We all had to grow up fast. I'd say that goes double for your boy. It's been a little terror since he arrived. <laughs> Excuse me? Let's just say he hasn't been happy without you around. At all. Well... Yo! We got walkers on the fence! Shit, 
I need to take care of this. Knowing Willie, it's probably two grandma walkers and an angry squirrel. Got bigger <laughs> fish. The kid's inside. Think he's with Lewis. Lewis? Oh, right. Uh, just listen for the music. You'll find him. Hey, get a move on, Willie. Where's your damn weapon? <laughs> she seems suspicious. Well, I'm not sure what's going on right now, but uh, I can say this guy's a little worried about some of these guys. Follow the music. Check. Oh boy, it's very loud wherever it is. No wonder there's walkers around. Someone did a real number on this place. They weren't taking any chances, it seems. Anything else? Hmm, can't go this way. Where is that music coming from? I feel like it's coming from this way. Master of fine ass. Master of big ass. Juris doctorate of ass. Yeah, these kids are definitely troubled. Sheesh. But I thought I had issues. I'm not wearing pants. PhD. PhD in ass. Damn. Pick up flowers. These look nice. Even if they're fake. Oh, they're fake? I kind of ruined it. Guess we go up here? Mm, nope. Music sounds like it's coming from this floor. Oh, maybe it's that other way. God, man. I, I am a little worried about these guys. Oh. Hey. Uh, Hi. Your little boy just bit me. I'm, I'm sorry. Took a boot to his head. Nearly took a chunk out of me. God, hurt so fierce. I'm so sorry. He acts out sometimes. He's been through a lot. Yeah, well, ain't we all? Don't see any of us sinking our teeth into either of you. Sorry. says you bit her. Is that true? I'm sure she didn't mean to scare you. I'm sorry, AJ. She can't said be biting one. people, man. I didn't want to hurt her. I know you didn't. But no more bites, okay? No more bites. You're not dead. That's good. Watch the kid for you. My name is AJ. Wait, why is the music playing? He's not even on the piano. Hold on. I'm going to turn the uh, music off for a minute. Just for now, guys. I don't know what's going on. Excuse me. I watched AJ for you. Oh. Okay, it's not the music, guys. I don't know what's wrong with it. All right. Thought it was the music. Guess not. Thanks. I appreciate it. No problem. Well, not no problem. He was a bit of a handful. But I got off light compared to what Ruby went through. AJ doesn't like people coming up behind him. Don't ever do it. 
<laughs> Loud and clear, little man. Thankfully, I was here to calm him down with my alluring music. I'm Louis. Clementine. Oh, yeah. Totally forgot. Marlon left your bag in here somewhere. Don't worry, I've got it. This uh, Lewis guy must be really good at the piano if he's able to take his hands off of it and still play it. Alright, Walking Dead. Gotta fix that. Um... Double, um... Does he know what that is? It's dirty. Clean it. Maybe later. Back you go. Where it belongs. Dude! That can't be a good idea. That thing's bigger than him. Is it actually loaded? Yes. Oh, good. He's earned my trust with it. He's a tot. Yeah, a tot who can shoot. You guys do your thing, I guess. You don't know any others? Well, there is one. But your arm... Uh-oh. I have no idea what's going on. I think the music just got bugged out or something. <laughs> what do you think, AJ? I don't know. It's loud. It is. Loud is bad. Not always. Come press this key. Come on. This one right here. <laughs> Go ahead, AJ. Press it. Now press this one, and this one. <laughs> You're a natural. Hey, have you seen Rosie? Nope. Shit. Got a bit of a situation out there. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Task, you're just coming to it all, but could really use a hand. You up for taking out a few deadheads? Sure. You too, Lewis. Get your ass in gear. <sighs> Fine. Okay. I'm so sorry, guys, about the music. I am. Rosie! It's still playing. Where the hell is she? You give her her weapon back? Good. We're gonna need you to put it to use. Hold on, guys. I think I'm gonna have to leave and rejoin. I'm sorry, guys. We're gonna have to leave and rejoin. I'm so sorry. I don't know what's going on, guys, with the music. Maybe it's glitched. I, I'm not sure. We're going to continue. I, I, I'm a little confused. It's been acting a little weird, so I don't know. I'm, I'm going to say this, guys. I am Rosie! completely shocked right now. Where the now. hell is she? There we go. It's stopped, give her guys. Her weapon back. Good. We're gonna need you to put it to use. We've got a hunting party out there trying to get back inside. Need our help to clear the way. Seems to be a few more than usual these last couple days. It's almost like something drew their attention. Something like, I don't know, an explosion or a car crash. Bye. <laughs> My what? bad. Just saying, there's gotta be some explanation. Look, I didn't know any of that was gonna happen. Sorry if it caused you guys problems. Uh, um. Hello, Clementine. I'm Violet. Nice to meet you. What he said. All right, boys and girls. They're starting to fill in. Come on. Be careful out there. Oh, trust oh, me. Violet. Clem doesn't she, uh, need it. Grows on you. I promise. Oh, this? It's a chair That's leg. the most shittiest weapon I've ever seen. Charles. 
I... Please, someone tell me how he's not dead. Run, let me help. I no, need you're to staying watch in my there. Back. Call out from inside if you see anything. Cool? Okay. See you on the other side. Two of them. much longer no kidding where'd all these walkers come from we can talk when we're back inside the gates keep an eye out for stragglers you know you're not half bad considering the circumstances and all thanks let's finish these guys off we don't need them attracting more walkers back to the school Piece of shit. I hate this cleanup bullshit. Oh, uh, hey, hey, yo, I don't know what your name is, but. Oh, shit, this bitch slapped me. Probably this bitch slapped me. What the hell is that? Holy shit. Oh my god. That is brutal. Brutal. No. Oh, whoa. Whoa. Girl, Not again. Hey. Shh, shh. Hey, hey. It's alright, girl. It's alright. Hey. Damn. See, you and Rosie are making friends. What is wrong with you? I had a bad experience people? with the dog ones. Well, Rosie here can help you get over it. She's as cuddly as they come. Oh, except for she's small and walkers, that is. Yeah, maybe get that cleaned up. Put that dog down. That walker came out of nowhere. All right, all right, fun's over. Let's get inside. Ah, fucking starving. You're not the only one. How'd it go out there? How do you think it went? Be nice, Asim. The safe stone's nearly dry. I could barely find enough for tonight. We're gonna have to scout out further if we want food for the winter. Talk about it later. Bullshit. We should talk about this right now. I said later, damn it. Still standing, I see. I'd call that a B plus performance there, Vi. You've done better. Fuck off. B minus then. Now, Clem here. That was a solid A. A plus even. Don't be jealous, Vi. Be better. Um, you kicked ass, Violet. A plus. I know. You're both delusional. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know.
little bit this loose guy. They're pretty good with the monsters. Come on, y'all. Boots. Oh. AJ. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ooh, I know that pain. Ah, oh, I'm really sorry about that. It's a goddamn wall, huh? I'm so sorry about that. It, it happens sometimes. <laughs> He's jumpy, little guy. You gonna be okay? He can't go around punching people into. No one expect me to eat at the same table. I'll talk to him. Hey. Hey. What are you looking at? What's that bird doing? That's gross. He should stop. So, we should talk about what just happened. It was an accident. I know. I didn't mean to hit him. I didn't know that it was Marvin. Marlin. Right. AJ, I'm sure they'll forgive you. But we should go talk to them. But... But I don't think they like me. I can just tell. They don't. Hmm. If they don't, let's go show them how wrong they are. I think I'll stay here. With the bird. <sighs> AJ, listen. We haven't eaten for days. The car is gone. All that's outside these walls are walkers. Do you really want to go back out there? No. So we should apologize to Marlin. Right now? Well, we can work up to it. Let's talk to the other kids first. Hmm. Well... What the fuck is that? I'm not sure anyone would pledge to that. Yeah, I'm not pledging to that. That is... Awkward. There's that girl, I bet. Better yeah. apologize, she looks pissed. You mean, say I'm sorry? Yes. She's scary and always seems so mad. You She's can probably do a it. big softy. You just gotta tell her why you did it. Because of my thing? Yep, it's nothing to be ashamed of. Just be honest. She definitely has Rebecca's hairstyle. Yes. And looks just like Alvin. I'm sorry I bit you sometimes. When I get scared, I do that, but I don't mean to. I just... I just get scared, and I'm sorry, and I hope your finger is okay. Oh, Shug, it's alright. We can all get a little crazy when we get scared. Thank you for your honesty and your apology. I did it! You sure did. Well, that, uh... That was interesting. I guess we should go explore, look for... What are they? Collectibles? I don't even know what they are. Hey, guys. Oh. What is this? Our graveyard. Can you guys still do that? Kinda, sorta. So, who's buried here? Nobody, really. This is where we buried Ten Sisters' belongings. Minnie and Sophie. Twins. Lost them. Both about a year ago. Paying respects. Should we do that too? Maybe? Yeah. I think that'd be a very nice thing to do, AJ. Come on. Thank you.
Well, that worked out in a way, I guess. Hello. Hello. Oh, hey. It's you two. Clementine, right? Yep. A sim, right? What are you writing? What happened today? I chronicle everything. Hmm. Like a diary? I try to think of it more like a history book. Those who do not cool. learn from the past and all that. <sighs> you seemed really mad at Marlin back there. He keeps pulling back the safe zone. We have fewer and fewer places to hunt. Which means we're gonna have fewer and fewer things to eat. The new girl went and helped the hun hunting party come back. She... Hey, zip it! That is not yours to read, kid. Give it back. It was just sitting there. So? So it was just sitting there. AJ, give it back to him. Okay. Thank you. This thing is the only place I get any real privacy around here. I gotta preserve what I can, you know? I gotta finish this before dinner. Not to be, like, rude, but, you know. Bye. Damn! It's messed up. Clem? Yeah? I'm ready. To talk to Marlin. Okay. Well, hold on. We haven't talked to everyone, though, have we? Mmm, yes. Hey, guys. Clem, AJ, this is Omar. Eh, excuse me. Chef Omar. Hello, and no, it's not ready yet. Omar's a perfectionist. The slightest flavor out of place, and he's grumpy for a week. You can eat oh. or you can eat right. All it'll cost you is a little patience. I'll let you guys know when we're done. They seem pretty nice, too. Omar seems pretty cool. Let's go check these guys out. I know one of them is definitely weird looking, but... Hey. Hey, you're new. Yo, what a fucking knife, man. That is awesome. I'm carving a weapon. Uh, yeah, I can see that. You're good at that. You like that, huh, little dude? You wanna see something cool? I wanna see. Yeah. <laughs> Pretty rad, huh? That's how you fuck up some monsters. Fuck up monsters, yeah. <laughs> that little dude said fuck. Well, that was interesting. I think that's everything. So I guess we could talk to them. Clementine, right? I'm Brody. He's a sweet little fella. Figured there ain't a lot of room for sweetness still out there. Yeah, he is pretty sweet. Not everybody sees that. I won't pay them no mind if you won't. I'm really sorry I hit you. Can we please stay here and eat dinner and not go out into the forest and get killed by monsters? Don't sweat it, buddy. You can make it up to me by teaching me your technique. You, a regular heavyweight. <laughs> hey, Clem! AJ! Gets it from Still's Alvin. Done. Guys, earn your supper after all. Ladies and gentlemen, dinner is served. Bro, that stew actually Thanks. looks pretty. Yeah, cool, actually. Yeah, can't remember the last time we had a hot meal. Mmm, this is really good. Mm. <laughs> Holy shit, Adri. Calm down. Oh, come on! <clears throat> you know what? Hold on. I'm gonna do it too. <laughs> oh, good lord! Enough! Thank you! 
Had to do it, sorry. Uh. <laughs> good night, Ruby. That was a good middle finger. Clem. I'm sorry, buddy. I'm sure they shared as much as they could. AJ, heads up. I'm full, kiddo. You can have the rest. You sure? You bet. <sighs> I'm all done. Mm-hmm. Me too. Now what? I'll tell you what. Time for something very important. Oh, God. oh. Good night. Violet, it's time. What's the game tonight, Lou? War. The oldest game around. A game played by man and beast alike. The only game there is. Get ready, losers. Cause it's time for you all to lose. Oh shit! <laughs> I like that. Bold talk. Uh uh. True talk. It's easy. Everyone gets a stack of cards. Everyone flips one over. Highest card wins. And the winner gets to ask Clem a question. Okay. What? I want to get to know you. We all do. And what if I win? Then you get to ask us one. It's only fair. Wait, what about AJ? What about him? <laughs> Looks like he's made a friend. Huh. Come on. You can take your eyes off him for one card game. Bet you both could use a break from each other. Yeah, maybe. This is his first time around anyone his own age. Sometimes he acts more like an adult than a kid. It's nice to see him act like a little boy again. Lewis, if you would. Hmm. Way to go, me. So, about AJ. Okay. Where are AJ's parents? You two don't really look related, so... <sighs> what happened there? They're dead. They were nice people. For the most part. It makes sense. He's a nice kid. For the most part. Hey, I win. Let's go, hey, baby. So, what do you want to know? <laughs> Worst injury you ever saw. I uh, saw a walker get hit in the head so hard both his eyeballs flew out. Pretty cool. I saw someone have their intestines pulled all the way out. Like, all the way. It goes on for a while. We got a lot of guts. I saw this guy get his face beaten in with a crowbar. Badly. There wasn't even any skin left. Carver. Ouch. Hmm. He deserved it. Come on, spit it out. So, uh, ever, uh, ever have a boyfriend? Oh my god. What? It happened. Perfectly valid question. You can ask me if I've ever had a girlfriend. I haven't, by the way. I met a boy one time. And? And we were friends. Just friends. Nothing else? Nothing at all? I don't know what you'd call them. But I had some sort of feelings for him. Maybe not exactly love, but something. Ah, I win. So, Clem, you can't have been alone this entire time. Who used to take care of you? Family? Oh. Anyone? The first person who taught me about survival was Lee. <laughs> What'd he teach you? Lots of stuff. Most important thing? How to shoot a gun. Useful stuff. Yeah, I taught AJ the same way too.
I win again. You do indeed. Ask away. <laughs> What's up with your haircut, Marlin? Oh, boy. Uh, w what do you mean? She means it looks like a dead cat. Probably smells like one, too. Uh, <laughs> I look cool. <laughs> Whatever you say. I say I look cool. <laughs> I wanted to ask earlier, but... Victory Violet. Here's something I love to ask when I'm in groups. <clears throat> Out of the four of us, who do you think is gonna die first? That is Ooh. fucked up. <laughs> oh. oh, I know. Lewis, definitely. 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 What? I'd have said the same. I am the greatest card player of all time. Just ask your damn question. I hope I hope it's Ever? not true about Lewis dying. Actually, never mind. What? Ask it. It's not a fun question. Ask. Ever had to kill someone you loved? Oh, it's definitely a hard Lewis. question. Hey, she wanted me to ask. Lee. His name was Lee. It was the same day I found out my parents were dead. That sounds like a rough day. Yeah, worst day of my life. I think I'm done playing for tonight. Yeah, it's probably for the best. You wanted me to ask. Let's go, AJ. Uh, good night. Night, AJ. Long day, huh? Yep, real long. Uh, I hope you know Lewis didn't mean any harm there. He's just the world's biggest dumbass. Yeah, he's my best friend, so I can legally call him that. So, guys, relax. Get some sleep. Feel human for a night. In the morning, come find me and talk about making this long term. If we can stay? We can talk about it. I kind of like everybody. I don't know about Brody yet. She hasn't really had that much talk, I guess. Where's Rudy? Or, or that looks like a really safe. Really? One. I don't know his name. It does. Good. This box has so many colors. Well, must have been an artist living in here. What's an artist? It's like a person who colors a lot, draws, does pictures. You mean like tin? Yeah, like tin. Huh. I like to do pictures too. Oh. Shit, I, I didn't know Marlon set you up in this room. I just wanted to grab something from the closet. Where the hell is it? Oh. What? That's what I was looking for. It belonged oh, to Sophie. Oh. Uh, Ten sister. He was asking for more art supplies and stuff, so I was going to. Oh, sorry. We didn't know. No, no. It's... It's fine, don't, don't worry about it. Honestly, it's just been sitting here for the past year and no one's touched it. If AJ wants to play with it, it's, it's fine. You should probably give the box back. It doesn't belong to us. Thanks, buddy. It's just that Ten wanted it since it was his sister's and all. It's yeah, okay. if it's a sisters, I'm glad we give it back. You can finish your drawing, though. I don't mind. Huh. I see you're, um, settling in. 
Yeah, is that okay? Sure, I guess. I always liked this room. Sophie had like paintings and shit on the walls. Lots of color. And Minerva, she was really musical. Not like Lewis though. She had actual talent. <laughs> she had the most amazing voice, real bluesy. Marlon always joked that he would scavenge a guitar and the two of them would tour the country. That was a long time ago. After they, afterwards Brody and Ten took down all the paintings and that was the end of it. I shouldn't have even brought it up. It's not a good memory. Guess I just lost my train of thought. No, oh, they sound like they were great friends. Yeah, Sophie was a good friend. And Minnie, uh, we were close. Me and her. Oh. What exactly happened to them, Sophie and Minerva? They went scavenging with Marlon and Brody out past the safe zone. Didn't make it back. It happens. Honestly, I just miss having someone around to talk to. There's just so many dudes. This place can get a little too bro town for my liking sometimes. <laughs> and I'm not exactly like a people person, you know? I know I sometimes have a habit, have a habit of being a little bit too harsh. You come off all right. I thought you were pretty cool. Oh, um, thanks, I guess. You were pretty cool, too, up there against those walkers. Hey, Clem, I'm an artist now. Not bad, kiddo. I should be getting back. Thanks again for the box. You're pretty cool, AJ. I think See everybody's ya. cool, yeah. but it feels like everybody's hiding something. Huh. Okay, Alvin Jr., time for bed. Okay, here. For me? For the wall, to make our home look nice. That's a good idea, AJ. How about here? Oh, so that's what they are. They're collectibles. That's what uh, we found AJ? with the flowers and stuff. Uh, hey why there. is he hiding under the what bed? What are you doing? This is where I'm gonna sleep. <laughs> what? No, it's not. It's safe under here. No one can get me. Come on, AJ. The bed is way better. Man, this bed is so comfy. What about the door? What if someone comes in? What if they try to hurt us? What if they steal our stuff? That door is really sturdy. Trust me. I tried to get out earlier today. It wasn't easy. Oh, I don't know. If I stay here, no one can find me. And I can keep guard and watch over you. I can protect us. <sighs> Hey, what's gotten into you? Please, Clem. It's not so bad down here. I'll be okay, I promise. Okay, okay, you can sleep under the bed. Here, for your head. Let me know if you get cold. I will. Okay, good night, AJ. Clem? Yeah, I'm glad we're not sleeping in the car anymore. Yeah, me too. Oh. He's gonna let us stay, right? I guess we're gonna find out. Let's find his office. I know where it is. I'll show you. Lewis, you actually better be playing that music. Up here. Come on, Clem.
come this way. Hey, AJ, wait up. I think he's actually playing the music. Tintu. Hey, Clem. Thanks for the pencils. I missed having colors. Sure thing. Who are these guys? They're firefighters. That one's a policeman. She's gonna save the day. But what are they? They... These were the people who protected us. Where are they? I've never seen one before. They all died a long time ago, trying to save everyone. Oh. They were weak. What? No. They were brave. Strong. Now, give it to me and... No, he's mine now. Hey, give it back. No. You don't even know what they are. Okay, okay. That's enough, you two. It's not yours anymore. It's mine. No, it's not. Ugh, fine. Thanks. Damn, AJ's turning out to pee. Do you know where Marvin is? Rebecca, in a lot of ways. I don't know. He should be around. I can go find him. That'd be nice. Thanks, Ten. Look. Hey, what'd you find? It's a picture of Marlon and Lewis. They're so little. Wow, they've known each other a long time, huh? I hate, I'm gonna, guys, I'm gonna test and see if, uh, sorry if the video is stopped. I'm trying to make sure that this is actually Lewis playing the piano this time instead of just. Because <laughs> it's annoying. I'm sorry. Lewis, you need to learn to play the different songs, man. Just say it. I'm gonna get some. Oh, he's actually playing the piano. Okay. He's gonna let us see. And stay, it's right? in this back here. Damn. I guess we're gonna find out. Let's find his. Guys, office. you can skip to at least three you. minutes ahead, and it should be back to where it is. Up here. Come on, Clem, this way. Hey, AJ, <sighs> wait up. My bad, guys. Tintu. Good. Hey, Clem. So Thanks for the pencils. Again. I missed having colors. Sure thing. Who are these guys? They are firefighters. <sighs> that one's a policeman. She's gonna save the day. But what are they? They... These were the people who protected us. Where are they? I've never seen one before. They all died a long time ago, trying to save everyone. Oh, they were weak. What? No. No. They were brave. Strong. Now, give it to me and... No, he's mine now. Hey, give it back. No. You don't even know what they are. Okay, okay. That's enough, you two. It's mine. No, it's not. Ugh, fine. Thanks. Do you know where Marlin is? It's okay. I don't know. He should be around. I can go find him. That'd be nice. Thanks, Ten. What'd you find? It's a picture of Marlon and Lewis. They're so little. Wow. I want to say Lewis is weird enough. Long photo. time, huh? Marlon? What the hell? Oh shit! 
No, 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 no. Chill, chill, chill. Oh, boy. Stay back. Come on now. Come on now. Come on. Whoa. Oh, God. God. Oh, God. Hey, hey, hey. It's okay, dude. You said dogs brought back bad memories. I'm sorry. I didn't realize you were so scared. But I swear, Rosie's not as frightening as she seems. Sit, girl. See? She's harmless. She just needs to get to know you is all. Oh. Uh... Here. I'll show you. Do you trust me? Yes and no. Rosie. <sighs> okay, I guess. Get down on her level. Then we'll get your scent. It's okay. She's not gonna hurt you. There you go. Now whistle and tell her to lie down. Lie down, Rosie. Thank God a dog did bite my arm and I had to surgically fix it myself. <laughs> So cool. See? Not so hard. Yeah. My dog now. That was pretty cool. Now Rosie will recognize you. She's really well trained. She was the headmaster's dog back when this place was Aww. still functional. When the world went to shit, we bailed. All the other adults did. Left us behind to fend for ourselves. Wow. What a dick. Understatement of the century. Now it's just us kids left. And I'd like it if you and AJ were a part of that. Both of you are plenty capable, and we need that. Here. This is the current state of our plan for gathering food. We are starting to run short. Oh. It's getting harder and harder to feed everyone in this school. Let's see. We shake the, the train, train tracks. There's a whole stash of food under the floorboards. Oh, where you crashed your car. Pretty sure that place a lost cause. There's a hell of a lot of smoke coming from it when we found you two. Walkers Damn. flooded in there after all the noise you made. Huh. Don't go here. Okay. The greenhouse. Oh, uh, yeah. Well, don't get too excited about that one. We used to maintain it real well. Had plenty of vegetables growing. But it became overgrown. Upkeep was impossible. Yeah, we, uh, we keep away from that now. Hunting area? What's the trap area? The hunting grounds, more or less. Lewis built some traps out there to catch game. He and a Sam are set to go check them today. What's out here? Oh, that's where we fish. Uh, got a shack for storage right here. Right along the river. It's secure, mostly. Get the occasional walker or two come by. Vine Brody should be heading out there in a bit. That's the only road that leads in and out of Erickson. If you go off it, you'll eventually end up in the valley. We used to have signs that led people to the school, but I took them down. I wanted this place to be hard to find. I didn't realize how much forest surrounds this place. It's how we've kept ourselves from unwanted attention for so long. Well, for the most part, anyway. One more thing. See these red lines? Yeah. So everything inside is the safe zone. It's been getting smaller over the years, and food's become more scarce. So, why not go outside it? <laughs> we can't. Whenever someone goes outside the safe zone, bad shit happens. People die or disappear. I just... <clears throat> I could really use the help, Clementine. Taking care of these kids, it's not easy. I'm worried that if I don't figure something out, if, if I don't fix our food situation, I can't lose anyone else. We've already lost mm. so much. Friends. Siblings. I... I get it. I know how it feels to lose a friend. Yeah. 
It sucks. Multiply that by 30, and you'll know how I feel. <gasps> what? Ha. Huh. Sorry. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to come off like a dick. I think I've lost more friends than you. Everyone's counting on me to step up. Be the leader they need me to be. I really want to be that for them. You and AJ are two more mouths to feed. Maybe you can help me feed the rest. So what do you need from us? Lewis and Asim are heading to the hunting grounds, looking for rabbits. Well, Asim will, anyway. Lewis, I uh, just hope he shows up, if I'm really being honest. Violet and Brody are going up river to do some spear fishing. And hopefully, oh boy. those two get along long enough to get some work done. Both teams could use some extra hands. You know what? We're gonna okay. go fishing. Okay. Take this. I don't want you getting lost. Thanks. We need all hands on deck if we're gonna find any more food. Just remember to stay in the safe zone. We need you to come back home in one piece. So that means we can stay? What? Do you think I was gonna throw you out? Maybe. Well, as long as we got enough to eat, you're both welcome here. Get him, AJ. All right, let's get going. What a cool guy. See you around. Okay. The music is glitched. I'm about to leave and rejoin. I don't know why it keeps playing his music. Lewis, what is wrong with you? Why are you everywhere? <laughs> Lewis, you gotta fix your music, man. What is going on? How far is this music box? I think it may fix it. I hope. I hope to God it fixes. Okay. I think he fixed it. Okay, good. You know, I've been thinking. I wish we could all go on a road trip together. Road trip? Why bother? It's not like there's anything worth seeing anymore. Oh, come on. I'm sure there's plenty of stuff to see. Maybe Clem could show us around. You're able to get a car working, and you know how to drive? Barely. Come on, bye. I've never driven in my life, but I'd love to learn. That sounds kind of nice. I love the open road. I wouldn't mind showing you around. Just as long as you're not the one driving. Are we oh, going come to the on. Car? No, bud. It's broken. Good. I'm sick of the car. Don't blame you. We've had a lot of I issues. Wish this old rust bucket was still working. We could just jump in and start driving. We could take turns sitting in the back. It'd be like driving one of those cars with the top that goes down. We'd run out of gas eventually. But still. It's fun to imagine, isn't it? <laughs> Where would you go, Clem? If you could drive anywhere you wanted. If gas wasn't an issue. Or a busted carburetor, or flat tires, or the transmission. Buzzkill. I'd drive down to the coastline. Maybe park on the beach and go swimming. That'd be an absolute dream. You could spend every day in the sun. And die of skin cancer. Fun. We're all gonna die. I'll take skin cancer over turning into a walker any day. Well, I mean, you'd I've still turn into a walker. I've lived here my entire life. Heck, I'd say I know every inch of these woods. I'd kind of like to unknow it. No use dreaming of what could be. We've got shit to do. Yeah, I guess we should get to work on those fish. We got spears inside the shack. Come on. You go ahead. I'll stay out here. Okay. Oh, what a dump. Where are those spears? I mean... Hey, about Bye. I'm sorry she's being a little mean. It's my fault. What do you mean? I was there when those walkers killed Sophie and Minnie. 
they were really close with Vi, and I think she blames me for what happened to them. I mean, how do you even apologize for something that fucked up? I don't know. Maybe I deserve it. You should talk to her about it. I'm sure she'll listen. <laughs> yeah, right. I tried. I have. It just never seems like the right time. We all used to be friends. <sighs> Guess I just kind of miss that. But when you showed up, I, I don't know. I just haven't seen her warm up to someone in a long time. Hmm. Do you? I mean, I hate to ask this of you, but do you think you could talk to her? See how she feels? About me? Sure thing, Brody. I can talk to her. Really? That's great. Thanks, Clementine. I'm gonna go check our fish traps downstream. Hey, what the hell is taking you two so long? We're kissing. See? I'll take this to Vi. <laughs> there should be some extras lying around. Sorry. I had to make that joke anyway. What the hell is this? What a dump. Just some old gardening supplies. Man, this place is more of a dump than when Lee died. At least their fucking bank had fucking shit everywhere. Huh, this is cool. Oh. Can I wear it? Edgy. Damn, it's cool. To go check up on AG. Hey you, what you looking at? V plus M. Violet oh. and Minerva. What does Ooh, that mean? Yeah. They were It means girlfriend. That they were a couple. What? Violet was Minnie's girlfriend. Oh. Love. Love. They were like, mm -hmm, and that was it. And they just walked away. She died. End of story, kid. That's all you need to know. Oh, I just did a 360 and picked up the spear. Cool. Whoa. Ready to get some fish? Yeah. Okay, let's go. This game has some weird bugs. That's a big ass fish. Can I join you? Sure. Hey, check out these guys over here. They're swimming against the current. Guess I don't realize it makes them easier targets. I wanna try. Take a spear. Go nuts. Good luck. Go ahead and try. Okay. They're not running. Mm. Hold hey, on, um, hold on. Sorry if I was weird last night about the whole room thing. Seeing someone else in there, uh, it was harder than I expected. You'd think I'd be less sentimental by now. Don't sweat it. I'm glad we got to know each other. <laughs> yeah, I guess I am too. Okay. It. How the hell did I miss? The hole's not looking that great. Uh, yeah. Okay. <sighs> God. Sometimes she just gets on my last nerve. You know? Yeah, I can tell. I mean, it's it's not like I hate her. I just. <clears throat> I wish we could all go on a road trip together. God, she's so. Oh. She definitely thinks you hate her. Holy shit. <laughs> shit. I'm not Looks good at this up. Maybe Brody had better luck with the traps. Catch anything? 
Nope, nothing. I did. Whoa, nice job. Damn, AJ's a better catch <laughs> oh, than me, shit. man. <laughs> I don't know what the problem is between us. With Brody. I don't know why it's like this. Why is it so weird? I can never relax around her. It just keeps getting worse. Because you blame her for what happened with the twins. Well, that's what I used to think. I just keep thinking that things might have ended differently if I was there. Maybe I could have protected Soph. And Minnie. It's okay. She wants to talk about it, you know. I just... I feel guilty about the whole thing. Why? I was supposed to be out with the twins that day. I wanted to work in the greenhouse, so I asked Brody to cover for me. But then... I didn't even get to say goodbye. I... I wanted to talk to Brody. To tell her I didn't blame her for what happened, but every time I tried, I was reminded of who we lost. It was easier to just not talk about it. We should get going. You guys catch any fish? We caught some, but not a lot. I didn't get anything. Three. We should catch up with Lewis and Asim. See if they had any better luck. Yeah, I suck at fishing. Give me a fishing pole. It's the a Grand different Canyon. story. What? That's where I'd go. If we took a road trip, start driving until we hit the Grand Canyon. Yeah. That would be cool. Thanks. Hey, you slow folks coming? Yeah, we're right behind you. It's gonna take me a little bit to get there. You see I'm old. <laughs> you know, guys, this has been a very intense series. Walking Dead just gives me no break. Where are those guys? Practicing making out with a toothless walker? Gross. I know. Poor I walker. don't even want to see it. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell? Oh, what? This isn't normal? Someone sabotaged this. This isn't good. A Sam? Lewis! Spread out. See if we can find them. Watch out for monsters. Oh, Empty. no. Huh. Is this a Bible page? Clem, found something. Got a sneaky fucking feeling that it could be a bad guy. Oh. Monster. Guys, over here! Oh. Well, we didn't kill this one. We wouldn't have left it hanging in our trap. What the hell? Found this too. Do any of the kids smoke? Nope. Nothing to smoke. Who is this unlucky fella? Where have you been? Checking nearby traps. The ones that were sprung were all empty. All the rest are broken. Someone robbed us? Oh, great. And now we're gonna starve. <sighs> Fuck. That's... Fuck. Fuck. It's just... Fuck. It's okay. It's... Breathe, Brody. Come on. Come on, come I feel on, like come on. something happened to the twins You're gonna be fine. she's not telling it's us, It's just a but, panic attack. Uh, or maybe she's just worried about the food. Take a second. Breathe in deep. And hold it. Just shut the fuck up, okay? Damn. Excuse me? I, I have to tell Marlon about this. Um, we still need food. You know, to live. We definitely don't have enough here. You guys figure it out. I'll take this hall back to school. And maybe we can ration out something. So what do we do? Eat rocks? You can't eat rocks. I'm aware. Will Marlon kick us out if we don't find food? Well, let's not find out. 
Where else could we look? Let me think. Let's see. I but we can't go outside the safe zone, I thought. Uh the train station. It's not too far from here. Maybe, but it's outside the safe zone. There was food in there when AJ and I passed through. It's worth a look. You sure there was food? Positive. Yeah, some of it was destroyed in the explosion, but there has to be something left. There was so much there. Or we could starve. Fine. Let's go. I hope we don't get in trouble for this. We were just trying to help. And of course there's walkers. Never a break. There. That's where the food is. A lot more walkers than last time, though. We're gonna die. It's either die here or die from hunger. Take your pick. Clem, maybe you should... I think I'd rather die out. from hunger. You know the place better. Let me get a closer look. Can't be too careful. The climb up there. I don't know how that would get us inside. I used that bell to attract a walker before. Could try it again. They do like to follow sound. You look like you've got an idea. The noise from that bell could draw a lot of walkers. If one of us climbs up there and starts ringing it... Lewis, I vote Lewis. Uh, hold on. I'd like to make an alternate suggestion. Come on, Lou. You're loud, dramatic, a little annoying. You're basically a walking distraction. Okay, Prince Charming. Let's see those talents in action. I can't say no to a face like that. I'll go with you. Give you some cover. Fine. I'll do it. But if I die, I'm making sure Walker Lewis eats both of you first. That's fair. I'll distract them until I see you guys reach safe cover. Then, I'll try to redirect the smelly patrol to give you guys a chance to sprint inside the building. When we get into position, I'll signal you. Then you can do your thing. Good luck! Bad luck this episode. I have not had this much bad luck. I've died at least five times in this hey, whole Alex. Walking Dead series. No, like. not you. Not you either. Okay.
okay. Yes, these will be perfect. Clem, look. Try it out, see if it works. Gonna need your help on this one, kiddo. You still got your gun? Oh boy. Just in case. He's got Just one bullet. Case. One bullet. It's not gonna help me right now. Good job, AJ. Is there more? Good thing. Keep it coming. Yo, I saw this banana stuff in uh, the first season. In the uh, van, if I'm correct. Stand. Oh shit. Slowly. Oh shit. Don't yell. Don't try anything. I won't hurt you. So you're the guy. I don't have to. Who are you? My name's Abel. And I'm hungry as hell. Your friends made a lot of noise out there. It wasn't hard to follow. You live close by? You knew about this place already and organized some effort to get inside. Just passing through. Decided to see what we could scavenge. Uh-huh. And you just got extra lucky. Young to be out on your own. You got a group. Count you plus the two outside. I'm thinking maybe more. You ask too many questions. I don't like it. Fine. We can play it like that. If you want. Now, I'm gonna fill this pack real slow. We worked hard to get this stuff. Well, hey there, Squirt. Playing hide-and-seek, are we? Now that's impolite. Don't steal from us. I'm not stealing. This isn't yours. I can kill you. I have an idea. Come on, kid. I'm faster than you. You may be faster, but this Listen kid can up, shoot. Squirt. You're gonna quit pointing that gun at me and let me go my merry. You understand? I'm just gonna take a little bit, then I'm leaving. Like it never happened. AJ, get down! Enjoy getting bit, bitch. What the fuck? Just take a bag and fill it up. We gotta be quick. It was a hard decision to make, but uh, I just killed a man. You are not listening to me, Marlon. Listen to me. I am telling you, the place was ransacked. It's fine. We'll deal with it.
Took y'all a while. How poor are they that have not patience? A Sim! Mitch! Check it out! Food! That's like a lot of food. Observant as ever, Mitch. I can't believe this. Look at it. You're our savior, Clem. Like, seriously, it's a lot. It was Lewis a team and effort. Too. Neither of them ever brought back this much before. Neither have you. Where did you find all this? The old train station. Clem knew where it was. Train station? That's outside the safe zone. We'd have even more, but we ran into the creep that fucked up our rabbit traps. Creep? What creep? Clem saw him smoking those nasty-ass Bible cigarettes. He had weird, different colored eyes. Did he follow you? No, oh, he's definitely dead. He shoved dead. into a pack of walkers. They took a chunk out of him. It was awesome. Look, I don't know if he got out of there, but if he did, he won't make it for long. You attacked him? What the fuck? If he survived, you know he's coming back for revenge. What the hell were you thinking? <sighs> this is fucked. If I hadn't done what I did, he would have shot us. I made the right call. Bullshit! What if there are others? You don't know what people are capable of out there. Think again. I, I just can't. I won't. Just not again. Fuck! What the hell's going on here? She took them outside the safe zone. They saw someone. You know what that means! Enough! Just means there's a hungry guy out there looking for food. It's happened before. You are overreacting. You can't be serious! Come on, let's go somewhere and talk about this. If anything happens, I'm holding you responsible! Clem. I know I asked you for help. You did. You did. But... Shit. God. Nothing's easy. Sorry I went outside the safe zone. I didn't see any other option. Yeah, I know. It's just hard keeping this together. <clears throat> well, at least we're eating tonight. For the next few, I'd wager. Uh, yikes, yikes, um, yikes. Go talk to Brody. Thanks for the haul, Clem. You guys should go enjoy it. You've earned it. Don't sweat it, Clem. Ever since we lost Sophie and Minnie, Brody's been freaked out by anything that happens past the safe zone. She'll be all right eventually. Still, we should make sure this is a one-time thing. We can take Rosie out in the morning, see if she catches a scent. You know, just in case. I'm gonna go clean up. I think I'll go too. See you later. Damn. I hope I'm just gonna Don't leave. Worry about them. They're just sad. Sad? Why? My sisters died around this time last year. I think it's starting to get to people. Doesn't it get to you? Not really. Dying's not scary. I mean, it's sad, but not scary. Being a walker is a lot worse than being dead. How do you know? Maybe being a walker is really nice. I doubt it. Oh yeah, Maybe eating too. people. But it's not like you can go ask one. I try not to focus on them being gone. I like picturing where they'd be now, instead. Sophie was awesome at making stuff. She'd build a place big enough for all of us to live. And paint it too. And Minnie be playing whatever new song she wrote. I guess death doesn't scare me because I know I have something waiting on the other side. 
Someplace safe and happy. All of us together. Looks like a nice place to wind up. Yeah, I think so too. A lot better than some smelly old school. <laughs> who are those guys? The walkers who killed them. You want them there too? They weren't always walkers. Wherever this place is, everyone gets to be a person again. Sometimes I draw the walkers the way they probably looked. Sometimes I draw Minnie and Sophie the way they probably left them. But sometimes I draw this too. Can... can I be there? Sure. You want to be there too? I promise I'll draw you well. Sure, why not? Oh, I almost forgot. Damn, he's actually really good. Okay, here you go. It's oh, yours. Thanks, Tim. It's ours. It's getting late. Yeah, you guys should get some sleep. Aren't you coming? Not yet. I want to finish this first. Good night. See you tomorrow. I wonder what's going on in Richmond with Javi and Kate and all of them. Yeah, I'm still sad we lost Gabe and David and Trip. Kenny, man. Time for bed, little guy. Can I stay up? Nope. Two more minutes. Tell you what, you lay down, and then we'll see. <laughs> you got in bed by yourself. I like it here. I got to kill fish. Violet looked like she was having a good time. It's nice not driving everywhere or running away. Uh, so true. But the ranch was nice too, before the blood. This isn't the ranch. Do you like it? I like it, now that I'm used to it. I do. I really do. It's good to feel safe somewhere. There, you gotta stay up two minutes more. Time for sleep. I'll lay down when you blow out the light. All right, give me a minute. I guess we can put the collectibles in places too, which is cool. That's cool. I know, right? Like, really cool. Let's see. So used to lugging this everywhere, never knowing when we'd find any supplies. I feel a lot lighter. There. That's a good drawing. He's a good artist. Your picture is good, too. Oh, I know. <laughs> There. You have to water flowers. Not these. They're fake. So they never die? Never. Well, lucky flowers. But they're not as pretty. Is there anything else I can place? No? Alright. That's it. It's cool about the collectibles, Good night, though. Sleep tight. Don't let a walker bite. And if they try, I never let them bite. Come on, play it right. One time. Bang. <laughs> Good work. And thanks. <sighs> Woo! It's been in the. Uh-huh. <laughs>
<laughs> That's arguing. There's voices in the pipes. I think someone's in trouble. Is it us? No, no, no. Not right now. But we should help them. If it's a monster, we should kill it. I don't think it is. You got your gun. What's going on? Uh-huh. I'll be right back. Stay safe. Okay, well, let's go see what's going on. It's probably just them arguing about what happened earlier, and she's overreacting, and then everything's fine. Boo hoo. It's coming from this way. Just a little farther. Basement. It's coming from in there. This locks from both sides. Can't pick it. I have to find another way to the basement. A cellar door out in the yard. I don't know what they're talking about, but it doesn't sound good. According to the map, there should be another entrance to the basement around here. It looked like it was over here on this side. Oh. Poor things having nightmares. I think it's over here though. Yeah, what the hell? A heavy brick. Not sure what I can use that for. But. Why is it always basements? Why? Why? It's every horror game has something to do with basements. Terribly. You don't even know for sure it was that one. She also said he got bit, which means he ain't gonna bother us. You know he's not alone. Those bastards are back and it's only a matter of time before they find us. You know that oh, shit! I knew you? it. What are you doing down here, in the dark? Brody and I were just talking. Go get some sleep. You deserve some shut-eye. You had a busy day. 
Didn't exactly sound like a polite conversation. What are you fighting about? It's really none of your business. Go back to the dorm. Uh... The man you met at the station! We got history. Brody! Don't listen to her, Clem. She's acting crazy. She gets this way sometimes. She's just got to tune it out. Don't be afraid, Brody. Say what you have to say. What history? Marlon let him take the twins. Him and his people. Brody! Why? Sisters. I thought they were killed by walkers. That's the story we told everyone. Shut up! Because Marlon was so ashamed Shut of what- Shut up! Oh my god! Oh my god! Marlin! Shit! What have you done? I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. You're gonna be okay. I, pr I promise. God damn it! Hell! Why did you say that? I told you not to say it! How? What can I do? Just, just stay with her. There's a first aid kit down here somewhere, right? First aid kit? Brody, it's me, Clem. Just, just stay still. Uh, who? Uh, I, I, I can't see. Clementine, remember? We talked about going to the beach, swimming, driving along the coast. Son. You and H.A. Bull. What danger? Marlon will kill me if I tell. He's scared. And when he's scared, he gets angry. Brody, if there's a threat to A.J., you have to tell me. Everything is so faint. I can't feel my legs. Please, try and focus. If those raiders come back, Marlon said he'd let them take you. Take us? To make him go away. Like he did. Like he did with ten sisters. Brody. Oh, fuck. No. Oh, no. Oh, no. Why did you do it, it man? I thought you were cool. Beside your hair, dude. She's gonna turn. Marlin! You fucking bastard. Marlin, you son of a bitch! Don't do I'm this! I'm sorry. I can't let you talk to the others. God damn it! Marlin! Anyone! AJ! Huh. There's a gap. If I could find something really thin. Force it in there and lift up the latch. The knife. What happened to the paddle knife or whatever the hell it was called? Yes, flashlight. That'll help. You're telling me we can't see in this? I can see fine. But it could be because I've got night vision, you know? Uh where did she go? I'm gulping a little bit. I'm a little scared. Oh god. Yes, this will work. Well, she turned. I think she turned very quickly. Oh, I don't like this. I don't like this. Hello? Hello?
Don't fail me now. Shit. Oh god, oh god, no! Okay, we gotta get back up here. <sighs> That's fucked what Marlin did, man. I feel like I know how this is gonna play out and I don't like it. AJ, put the gun down. Get this fucking cycle away from me! Where is she? she? She's in the basement. She murdered Brody. What? Is that blood on your face? Why Brody? Did you see it happen? Is she a walker now? Hey, Marlin! You might want to get your story straight. Clem! You killed Brody. You hit her so hard, her head split open. That's a lie! I saw you kill her! What the hell is going on? Look at her hands! She's covered in Brody's blood! Jesus Christ, Clap, what did you do? About. He won't do it, because he needs us alive. Shut up! Brody told me Marlin was gonna give me and AJ up to Raiders in exchange for safety. The same way he gave up Sophie and Minnie. Oh my god. Shut the fuck up, Clementine! Let her talk! Brody told me the truth, and that's when Marlin killed her! Oh, come the fuck on! They only met up with these Raiders because Clem insisted they go out there. Quite the coincidence, isn't it? Shame, I don't believe in those. Think about how scared we all were when the adults left. I pulled us out of that fear. I gave us all courage again. Who are you all gonna believe, huh? Johnny come lately and her little fucking lunatic? Or me, your friend? She did help us get food. What good is food if a group of outsiders is just gonna come along and take it? You have to believe me. You don't! You met her like two days ago! I don't know you, Clem. Not really. I'm sorry. I guess you never will. Don't let her get in your head. Hey, what did Minnie want you to do? She was my friend, too. So was Brody. Clem, I... <sighs> Shit. It will all feel safer once I pull this trigger. If you were there that day those raiders came, he would have abandoned you, too.
Violet being difficult. Why am I not surprised? Put down the gun, now. We're gonna do this the right way. Stand down, Marvel. Be reasonable. understand it all, do you? I'm trying to protect you! Am I aiming a gun around? All of you! Every fucking one of you! How does pointing a loaded gun around protect anyone? Rhodey's dead. Sophie and Minerva are gone. You suck at protection. Shut your fucking mouth! I made the right call. I saved the lives of everyone in this fucking school! I came back, i do it again! Excuse me? I didn't realize we were so fucking expendable! They told me they died! I had to save the rest of you, okay? You gave my sisters away. Why would you do something like that? I trusted you, Marlin. They trusted you. He was in a tight spot. He did the wrong thing, but he thought it was for the right reason. That doesn't mean he shouldn't have to pay for it. I wanted to get them... ...states... ...some kind of rescue. Honest, Ted, I just couldn't. I was... ...was too afraid. You killed Brody because... ...she knew. <laughs> I didn't mean to. I didn't want this. I wanted to save all of you, Sophie, Minerva. We can still fix this, Marlin. It's going to be okay. We can make this right. We'll help you. We're all family here. The only one any of us has left. I know I betrayed you. All of you. Just let me leave. You'll never have to see me again. Just let me become a bad memory. Just give me that. Please. Fine. Episode 1.